Thanks, Reggie. And thanks to everyone watching for tuning in and joining us for another Nintendo Treehouse Live at E3. We're really excited to get started. So as uh, Reggie mentioned, I'm Sam from Nintendo. And joining me up here, I've got Terry from Nintendo hey. and my colleague David from TPCI. And we've also got our very special guests, uh, Masuda-san and Omori-san from Game Freak, who are joining us to chat about Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon. Now, uh, Pokemon fans already know that you guys have a very long history of working with the Pokemon franchise. But can you tell our viewers a little bit more about what you guys are doing specifically with Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon? まあ、2周年ということで、え、ま、ここから先のポケモンを未来に向けてのポケモンということで、私はあのプロデュースに徹して、え、今回、え、シゲルオモリが、え、ディレクターという新しい体制で取り組みました。so this is the 20th anniversary of Pokemon, as I think many of you know. And when thinking about the future of Pokemon, uh, I've decided that I would be the producer uh, on this title and also and pass over the uh, director role over to Shigeru Omori here for Pokemon Sun and Moon. Uh,と今回えっとポケットモンスターサンムーンのえっとディレクターをしました。大森と申します。えっと今回はディレクターとして開発全体をに携わりました。so I'm Shigeru Omori from Game Freak, and I was the director on this game, overseeing the entire development of it. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. I know you brought some art assets that we can take a look at to introduce folks to the Pokemon Moon, Pokemon Sun collection. But first, we've actually got some video footage that you brought for us. So uh, folks watching, if you sit tight, we're actually going to get that queued up for you so you can take a look. All right, so there's a lot for us to talk about just from the footage there. Uh, the first thing I'd like to actually uh, ask you is uh, if you could tell us a little bit more about the background of why you went with Sun and Moon as the titles for these games. あの、ま、私たちのあの住んでいるこの地球っていうところにはま、生き物がたくさんいるわけですけども、ま、その中でえ、ま、その生き物に対してとても影響があるえ、ま、そのコアとなっているものっていうのはやっぱり太陽と月
、えー、関係してくる2匹になりますので、えー、楽しみにしていってほしいなと思います。So in, in the games, the legends say that、uh, Sol Galio and、uh, Lunala are the emissaries of the sun and the moon, respectively.、Uh, and they, these two legendary Pokemon actually they kind of play a unique role. They tie into the story in a unique way that we really haven't done with pairs of、uh, legendary Pokemon before. So I think fans will be really excited about it. I think there's a really interesting spiritual element that we get in these games. I won't talk about that too much yet because I know we're saving some surprises. But on the subject of legendaries, I know、um, you recently had an event in Taiwan where you revealed some news about another legendary Pokemon folks remember from XY and what they might expect from that Pokemon in these games.、Uh, we can maybe talk about that a little bit too. Just the Densense Pokemon, the Hanashi, the Sensitive, just on Taiwan, the XY, the Densense Pokemon, 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 the あのいよいよあの 10% ジガルデとあのパーフェクトジガルデがまあサンムーンに登場するというお知らせがえ出ましたけどもえまあ今回あのこのまあジガルデも活躍するっていうのがまああのポイントかなと思います。So uh, uh, Zygard, uh, the Pokemon that... One of the legendary Pokemon that appeared in、uh, originally、oh, Pokemon X and、nice. Y. It has、awesome. recently showed off their,、uh, the 10% form and complete form、uh, in the games. And these Pokemon will, or these forms will appear in Pokemon Sun and Moon kind of a, a, in a special way that I think、uh, people will be excited about. Ah, they look so cool. And, and actually,、uh, here, since we're looking at a little bit of the Alola region in the background,、uh, this is probably a good chance to talk、uh, maybe a little bit more detail about the Alola region and what players can maybe expect there. Well, the Konkai, the Boken, the Bhutai, the Alola, 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 名前なんですけども、えー、と名前の由来としては、えー、命を育みで、まあ、命を育み生命力にあふれる大地という意味を込めてこの名前にしました。Uh, so, the Alola region, as you can see, is made up of these、uh, four islands. It has a, a man made island as well.、Um, but it's really、uh, this region that's just like a teeming with life. And that's actually behind the, the name of the region itself. We have this、uh, meaning of kind of a、uh, uh, region over, like a miraculous region overflowing with this life force that can support all this different、uh, life. And,、um, Yeah, I think it's really interesting since it's not connected to any of the other regions. You've、yeah. got this really interesting area of isolation, and we're seeing all these Pokemon that nobody's ever run into before. And it's almost kind of feels like the Galapagos Islands, where you've got this really interesting remote area where all these other creatures are, are popping up, and you've got new Pokemon and a really cool environment as well to explore. Yeah, it's not connected to any of the other regions. It's not connected to any of the other regions. It's not connected to any of the other regions. It's not connected to any of the other regions. It's not connected to any of the other regions. It's not connected to any of the other regions. It's not connected to any of the other regions. It's not connected to any of the other regions. I've been playing it at work and I'm very excited. <laughs> Let's <laughs> get a look at it. <laughs> and actually, since we're talking about new Pokemon,、um, is there anything more that you can tell our viewers about the three starters that they'll be choosing from in this game? So, this is the first time I've been in the game. So, this is the first time I've been in the game. So, this is the first time I've been in the game. And、so、of course, they're all very cute, but、uh, one of the things I really focused on with these three in particular is making their movements really cute when they're represented in the game. Like, for example, in battle and other parts in the game, you see them moving around, and they're really cute, kind of make you want to reach out and touch them almost. And then, of course, the world is very cute, the world is very cute, and the world is very cute. のカラー、まあ、草タイプだったらグリーンが入っていたりとかっていうその分かりやすさっていうのをやっぱりあの最初の3匹は大事にしています。And another thing we always、uh, pay attention to with or really focus on with the initial Pokemon that you choose for your partner is、uh, making them kind of universally relatable so people from around the world will be able to look at these Pokemon and relate with them very easily and also very easy to understand like for example the grass type Pokemon is going to be green obviously so being careful with the colors.、Mm-hmm. I think what folks have seen already from the animations that we've shown in a little bit of video footage we've been able to share they They have a lot of personality.、Um, I actually picked Poplio because I'm a hardcore water starter fan. My first was a Squirtle, and I've stuck with them. But I've been having a great time so far, and I, 
I'm, I'm we're looking forward to seeing what other folks pick when they get into the starters as well. And it's interesting actually what you talked about with the, the design of the starter Pokemon. And I think they also really fit nicely in with the kind of tropical climate and environment we've got. And I know that's something that you worked in with the design of the player characters as well this time around. ま、今回ま、南の国っていうような設定になってて、ま、アニメの、え、ポケモンもすごくそれに合ってる感じだと思うんですけど、今回の主人公のデザインもやっぱそれを意識されてる部分もありますかそうですね。あの、やっぱり
staying still in the battle for a moment, and you really get a good chance to get a look at these Pokemon and the area that you're in and the environment. まあ、こうやってあの、1回、ま、テレビ今止まってくれてるんですけれども、ま、こう、カメラの演出を見せたりとか、ま、やっぱこういうかっこいいカメラの演出があって、すごいこう、バトルフィールドの全体を見渡せ
I feel kind of bad for it though. I feel like you just throw out a bag of chips or something <laughs> and it'd be like, thank you. So it's you. twice as much today, so I'll be back in the main channel. Oh, oh, getting close there. I'm not scared of it. Scared of it. You'll probably be able to catch this one. We're on our way. Oh, good luck. That's two down. Nice, yes, man. Yeah, this is always like the most stressful seconds in any Pokemon player's life. And actually, this will give us a chance to maybe take a look at the Pokedex. So we've got a new Pokemon to check out. Oh. So we've got some uh, some interesting changes coming to the Pokedex in this game. Um, can you tell us a little bit more about what fans can expect from the new Pokedex? ま、今回図鑑がちょっとあの変わった感じで新しくなってるんですけども、このえ、ま、今回の図鑑についてちょっともうちょっと話してもらえますか。そうですね。えっと、今回えっと、ロトム図鑑というものがあります。えっと、この
ごいやる気ですねこの子<笑>ヤングースですね<笑> Another young goose looks like Now we can see as Terry's battling here、um, with how the battle interface is set up it's Really easy to just get super involved in the battle to, to whatever extent you want to be.、Um, you've got all this information at your fingertips. It's not that you have to look at it all, but it's so nice that if there's anything that you need to check on, you can do it so quickly、mm -hmm. and, and you still feel really immersed in the battle. やっぱそうですねあのバトルのインターフェースでこういろんな情報を今,、まあ、今回覚えなくてもいいという話だったんですけども、はいまあ、見たいときはもうあのタッチ一つでこうやっぱこう情報をすぐに出せるのがやっぱこう便利ですね。あそうですね、やっぱりこうバトルをしていて、まあ、こいつ、どんな状態だったっけとか、まあ、そういったことがすぐこう情報に出せるということは、初心者でも、まあ、この奥深いバトルに、まあ、とっつきやすくなるかなと、出ました。<笑> so yeah, There's a lot of depth to the battles, but you don't have, for example, beginners, for example, maybe they don't want to or they won't remember a lot of these uh, uh, different status changes and whatnot, but you can really quickly check on the, the state and see how things have changed. I'll say, I, I love Young Goose's painting animation. <laughs> 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 just so cute. I always have a soft spot for Pokemon. Oh, there we go. It's a Tsukera. It's a Tsukera Pokemon. It's a Tsukera Pokemon. It's a Tsukera Pokemon. This is a pick a pick. It's called the wood poker, or excuse me, the wood, wood peck. <laughs> I, I can't even speak. But,、uh, so, the, the setting of this Pokemon is that it can actually peck 16 times in one second. So, it's got a very fast、uh, beak. 16回というのは特徴だよね。16回というのは大事。<laughs> We're very particular about the number 16. <laughs> Yeah, watching its animation as it's, it, it's got very bird like movements as it's kind of twitching its head side to side. And I think that the level of detail that you guys have put into all the Pokemon animations in this game is really fantastic. Pokemon, so there's a new look to us. We're going to come back and set the city to have a shot on the cat. Oh, no, no, Terry! 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 As a good chance to mention, actually,、uh, we did find a Pokeball earlier as we were walking around. And you can find some good items to help you out along the way that can help you heal up your Pokemon. and... High risk to catch them all. Your ladybug got a level out of that, though. Well, this is a level up. Baby Bunga. Almost another one. This is definitely one of the things that really makes Pokemon a fun game. This kind of like sense of tension here. So, do we have anything we can give Papu Yoda? I think it's time to go to the festival. Oh, you're ready. You're ready. Oh, no. We'll just run from this one. All right. I'm going to run from this one. All right. I'm going to run from this one. Oh, young goose. <laughs> oh, young goose. They must have. Terry, you gonna heal up after this?、Or? Yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll get healed up. We'll get healed up. I think before we get to、up. the festival, because that's.、Yep. Not to give too much away, but there's.、Hmm? There's more fighting in your future.、Mm -hmm. More fighting. <laughs> so,、uh, actually, as we come into the, this area here, we're going to be meeting several different characters that、uh, our viewers maybe aren't familiar with.、Uh, would you mind just giving us a quick introduction to them? Yes, I'm going to give you a quick introduction to them. Yes, I'm going to give you a quick introduction to them. I'm going to give you a quick introduction to them. I'm going to give you a quick introduction to them. I'm going to give you a quick introduction to them. So, this is Hala. I think it's been revealed. Uh, already in a、uh, video that we've released, but、uh, it's a really strong trainer on this island, and he's actually the、uh, guy who gives you your first、uh, partner Pokemon in your adventure. A very strong trainer on this island. This is Hau. This is Hau. This is Hau. This is Hau. So, this is how, and you're about to battle him actually、uh, as part of this festival. 
、えー、ククイですね、えー、とポケモン博士です。今回は、えー、と技の研究をしているという博士ですね。And that's Professor Kukui right there in the white lab coat. He's a professor who specializes in researching Pokemon moves, so like their attacks and such. Yeah, I think based on the fan response I've seen, he is quickly becoming the most dreamy professor. <laughs> Thank you for the fans. I'm not sure if I'm a professor. I'm not sure if I'm a professor. I'm not sure if I'm a あとリリエですね。えっ、ー、とポケモンのトレーナーではないんですけども、今後も一緒に冒険するキャラクターです。And that's uh, Lily uh, behind you there. She's the、uh, assistant of Professor Kukui, and she's not a Pokemon trainer, but she'll join you on your adventure throughout the story. And sharp eyed viewers may have noticed her bag is kind of interesting. <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑>ちょっと彼女が持っているまあバッグちょっと気になりますね。<笑>カバンの方は。なんかありましたか今。<笑> Was there something there? Yeah. <笑>いやもう<笑>ちょっとね<笑>さっき動いてたけどね。<笑>でもまだまだ言えない。まだ言えない。Gotta keep this secret, unfortunately. <笑>動いてたの見ちゃった。見さ見さ見さ。I think it's time we go into the festival battle. じゃあそろそろ祭りのバトルになりますか。So I think it's going to be really interesting for fans of the series to see this battle and and the space. The way that Pokemon and Pokemon battles are integrated into the culture in these islands is really interesting, and you get these amazing battle spaces where. Other folks are gathering around and, and watching you guys fight. Yeah, it's interesting to see the battle. So, in this,、uh, in this particular festival, actually, this is kind of a, a celebration or a way to kind of kick off both you and Hao's adventures to kind of travel across the island. So, it's kind of a, a ritual in this society.、Mm. And、uh, folks may have noticed there was、uh, another thing where we can't really talk about too much, but just to mention Tapu Koko. Ah, so、Worth paying attention to that name. So, how about a Pichu? Who looks adorable? Don't lose this time, Jerry. Leave it to me. And here we can see, see what he's done for checking、him. different effects. Ah, okay. So, the parameter is how it's going to be. And you can see both your status changes as well as the opponent's status changes、mm-hmm. to really see what's going on in the battle. So, looking at this tropical environment, I'm really hoping that you guys were able to pull off some business trips to some nice tropical locations, maybe. I mean, it's for research, it's work. <laughs> ですね。はい。うわ、エンドスキルナイス。私技を覚えてる。うん。There So at this point in the story, you see、uh, Hao has Litten,、uh, which is another one of the first Pokemon you can choose in your adventure. But you've actually encountered,、uh, you battled against him and his Litten once in the story. And so once you've, in Pokemon Sun and Moon, once you've battled the Pokemon once, the next time you battle it, you'll get information on your move list about which moves are effective、right. and which ones aren't. It's super effective. It's a super effective. 
So just explaining that, you know, modern gun is a super effective Yeah, what it means. I think I'll stick with that one. Yeah. 初心者でも分かりやすいふうにしています. So it's just coming back to make it all very easy to understand for even beginners of the games. Oh. That really is so nice to have that information. I think especially when you're trying to catch more Pokemon, and you're like, okay, I, I actually maybe don't want to be super effective yeah. right now. I need to kind of whittle this Pokemon down. So yeah. being able to remember maybe you want to use your weaker oh. attacks sometimes just to kind of get them yeah. just to that point. I love what a good sport how is about losing too. He's just kind of rolling with it. It's all good. <laughs> <laughs> So I don't think we can go too much further in the gameplay because we're going to start giving away story elements that we don't want to show folks yet. Um, but you did bring another video for us to take a look at that has um, a new gameplay mode that uh, I don't think folks have seen before. この先やっぱ実機プレイを進めるとあのまストーリーのネタバレ的なところも出てしまうことになるのでまあここまでにして初めて今回初登場の新モードという理解ですあのポケモンはやっぱりコミュニケーションとツールとして今までこう対戦と
ね。まあちょっと時間が来てしまいましたけれども、えー、まあ今回のポケモンサンムーン発表されてから、えー、多分ファンからの反響というのはあるんですけれども、そのまあ手応えについてお話してもらえますか。そうですね。あのー、今回七言語から九言語に中文を増やしまして。えー、特にその中文使われてる人たちからもたくさんあの反響いただいてまして、まあ、自分のツイッターとか、あのー、いただいてるんですけどもやっぱりこう、まあ、ポケモン20周年ということもあってここからさらにこう広がりを見せるために、まあ、非常にこうみんなが喜んでくれて、まあ、とても嬉しいなと思ってます。So,、uh, yes, the, fan, the reaction from everyone has been really great. You know, I get tons of messages and tweets and everything.、Uh, this being the, you know, the 20th anniversary of Pokemon,、uh, one of the goals we really want to kind of, you know, for the future of Pokemon, really kind of expand it to even a wider audience. And as I think you, we've announced previously,、uh, in the, addition to the seven languages we had in、uh, X and Y and Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire, we also added、uh, Chinese,、uh, simplified Chinese and、uh, traditional Chinese. And I think a lot of the, especially from、uh, those regions, like fans have. Really been kind of excited about it and sending me lots of、uh, great messages. And、uh, is there anything、uh, final that you'd like to wrap up and say to fans who are watching the stream right now? Just the last one, and the fans have a message to you. Is there anything else? So, this is a very important challenge that this software has been doing for a long time. So, yeah, I think、uh, Sun and Moon, we're、uh, really doing a lot of new challenges for, for us here as Game Freak, so I hope everyone really just looks forward to the games. Well, thank you.、Hey. えっとまあ、自分も完全新作としてのディレクター初めてだったんで、まあ、たくさんの苦労があったんですけどもその甲斐があってすごいいいゲームができたので期待しててください。So, there was a lot of challenges for me, especially as、uh, it's the first time directing an, you know, an entirely new generation of Pokemon at Game Freak. But I think we've really、uh, brought the game together. It's really turned into something fantastic, and I hope fans really look forward to it. I, I know I'm definitely looking forward to it. And thank you so much、uh, for joining us and giving us some insight into the development work here.、Uh, folks watching again, that was Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon, which are coming out for the Nintendo 3DS family of systems this November, so you don't have to wait too much longer. And、uh, please.